world shake What's up guys, your boy Omega here with another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to make pretty good custom thumbnails using the PS4 Share Factory if you don't necessarily have the best computer, PC, all that shit, right? Uh, for example, me. I don't have the very best computer, PC, all that, so I edit my videos using my phone, my not so good PC, and the PS4 Share Factory. So in this video, this tutorial of many, I'm going to show you how to make a pretty good custom thumbnail using the PS4 Share Factory. Yes, I know I said it once. Well, now I said it twice. Well, what you want to do is go over to whatever frame you want to start the thumbnail and, you know, edit text, add stickers, all that. This is, for example, um, a free throw with my friends. All right, let's, uh, black screen. All right, what you want to do is press X on wherever you want to. Um, start editing, making your thumbnail, and press Add Overlay. Once you've done that, click on, there's going to be three options. Stickers, theme stickers, and text. Stickers are like the all-around stickers you get with the Share Factory. These two I have because the Bulls logo is my um, avatar, and this is a picture I uploaded myself, which I have on right now. And the theme stickers are the stickers of whatever theme you currently have on. So for example, if you have the um, a um, Black Ops 3 theme that you get from the PlayStation Store, you'll obviously get the uh Black Ops 3 uh Black Ops 3 stickers for the overlay, right? And then we have text. We all know what this is going to be. There there's the big text, medium text, and small text. So for example, let's go on big text. Let's just put Black Ops 3 F F A. Alright, and you're gonna have multiple options. You're gonna have transform, opacity, color, justify, edit text, delete text, and the layer order. To move it around, transform, you know, um, just press transform. Easy as that. And then once you've uh, liked where you've positioned it, oh, you could also uh, turn it around using L2 and R2. So once you move moved it around, you like where it goes. Let's see, for example, just put this one in the middle. All right, like that. And then once you're done editing it, just press just press circle. And then if you want to edit it again, press edit um square. Press square, edit overlays and there we go. The opacity there goes the opacity, the color, you could uh, change the color, let's see, let's just change this to red, you could just find the center, the right and the left, edit text, you know, what you want, what you want it to say, delete text, and the layer order. So now that we have that, let's say you want to add some stickers, so put add overlay. So let's go over to stickers. And since it was a, a free for all, I pwned them, pwned them nubs. So um, I just clicked on that sticker, and then you could transform it, its opacity, edit its opacity, delete the sticker, and edit the layer order. So transform it. Uh, um, you can't change the color since it's a sticker. Let's just put this in the corner right here, and press circle again once you're done editing that one. And if you want to edit something else, again, X, add overlay. Let's put this fire since that free for all was fire since I won. Circle, and then let's just say you like this thumbnail. You like it, you ship it there, that one. What you're going to do is press L2 on the controller. Wait for the bottom options, R2 and circle, to disappear completely. And what you're going to do at this point is something I can't show you on screen because I'm currently recording this with the share factory incorporating the PS4 you know the recording and then so what you're gonna wanna do because if I do do that it'll end the recording but what you're gonna wanna do is uh, press the share button and where it'll say upload upload screenshot something like that upload screenshot upload photo share photo something like that 
but it'll be the second square. There's four squares in total, or three. I don't know. I forgot. <laughs> uh, and then it's just the second rectangle square. It'll be the second square. Click on that on the square itself. Click on it, and then it'll tell you where you want to. It'll ask you to choose where you want to share it to, either Facebook, Twitter, or the messages. So. To make this a thumbnail, you got to share it to either Facebook or Twitter. And then you will uh, share it to there. For example, I primarily use Twitter. So I post all my custom thumbnails on there uh, so that I could save them afterwards. And if your um, your account is, isn't already linked with the PS4, just type in or enter in your details, share it to there, tweet it out. Easy as that. It isn't that difficult. But um, after that, if you um, you can save it. If you're using your computer, just save it. Easy as that. Or if you want to use a phone, since you can't use your computer, check out my video on how to edit videos, add custom thumbnails, etc. onto your YouTube videos using iOS and Android. Hope you guys enjoyed this little tutorial. I'm gonna be rolling out a lot more of these soon to help out those uh, upcoming small YouTubers. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope it was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, you know, any questions, put them in the comments and I'll try to help you as best as I can. It's been your boy Omega. Like and subscribe. Peace.